Doctors at Chio have become the first in the province to perform an innovative surgery that could change the way scoliosis is treated. Those with the condition have a curve in their spine and this new option allows it to be corrected with a faster recovery time and more long-term flexibility. CTV's Katie Griffin explains. 17-year-old Olivia Coote lived in the pool. I really liked just the activity of it and it was relaxing. A competitive swimmer, it was in 2016 when she was diagnosed with scoliosis. She had a curve in her spine. She was very insecure about um, the way she looked. She was noticeably uh, folded in on one side. A restrictive brace worn 18 hours a day didn't work. The next step was surgery, the most common, spinal fusion. It is really scary to hear that your child is going to need rods put in their back <laughs> with, you know, 20 plus screws. Doctors at Chio presented another option called Apifix, a new innovative procedure that means a quicker recovery and better long-term flexibility. It uses a ratchet device that allows you to distract the spine, to stretch out the scoliosis and correct it without fusing it, which is quite different than a lot of the stuff that has been used in the past. Olivia is the first person in Ontario to have the procedure done. It's pretty crazy. I wasn't expecting that much correction. And really, this opportunity has been pretty life-changing. There you go. Good job. She was walking hours after surgery. A month after surgery, she's going up and down stairs and she's back in her room and and it's just night and day versus what the traditional options are. Donor dollars instrumental in funding groundbreaking research like this. Without that support, we can't look into the long-term outcomes of these patients. Uh, we can't do the research and register them into these spine registries. You know, without them, we can't have some of the equipment that, that we use to do these amazing surgeries on kids and teenagers. Our experience with Chio was phenomenal from beginning to end. Olivia's case will now be brought to an international research group to help advance innovation in treatment for other patients like her. To have an option where you can maintain some flexibility and you're not affecting the whole spine for um, a curve that's in a certain part, it, it really is hopefully something more people can experience. With progress made every day, Olivia looking forward to getting back into sports with no pain. I've already been thinking about getting a membership at the pool again because I guess I'm able to do that now. Katie Griffin, CTV News. Your continued support makes a difference in the lives of the children at CHEO. Please visit CHEOFoundation.com and donate today.